just watching the person falling through their phases and just be looking at them and them looking back but not knowing who you were. My grandma had Alzheimer's for three years almost and it was just really hard to watch her like deteriorate like that because she was such a strong like person in my life and just to see such a sharp-minded and like amazingly strong person deteriorate into just a body was just really hard to watch. Um, it's really sad like they don't remember anything you've talked about and you like walk through the same conversation over and over. It's really upsetting to know that they have no idea who you are even though they've known you your entire life and they just don't recognize you. It's been depressing just watching the person descend into the final stage. It got really bad to the point where she could only speak in Spanish because um, she knew English too, but it's like she forgot how to speak it altogether. And she didn't recognize any of my members other than my older brother. And she thought my older brother was my dad, even though he wasn't. Maybe what the end would look like because we had no idea. We had we didn't know anything. We had never experienced that with our family. So I guess just wanting to know what lied ahead. I wish I'd known that there's no cure. I thought maybe there was a way to slow it down or something, but I... I wish I had known how it would end and what the final thing would be. I wish I could know that there wasn't a cure because I thought there was. Like when I was little, I thought there were like cures for everything, but that's not true. So I wish I could have had more time with her knowing that. Cherish all those precious moments that you have, like those extra trips to visit your grandparents or just little the little things. Just cherish those because you never know when they'll be gone like that spend more time with them. I know I didn't spend enough time with either of them. My grandma's friend, I didn't visit her enough and I wish I had. I would tell them to spend a lot more time with their family members and stick with them and do more things with them. And as your brain starts deteriorating away, stick close with them always. Remember the old person that you want to remember. And then every time you look at that person, remember that face.